The study aimed to assess the effects of oral cannabinoids on systemic inflammation in people with HIV, PWH, on antiretroviral therapy, ART. 10 PWH were randomized into two groups, increasing doses of oral delta-9 tetrahydrocannabinol, THC cannabidiol, CBD, combination or CBD-only capsules for 12 weeks. Blood specimens were collected before and during treatment, and plasma cytokine levels, immune cell subsets, HIV DNA slash RNA levels in circulating CD4 T cells and sperm, and other inflammatory markers were measured. The results showed that plasma levels of IFN gamma, IL, 1 beta, STNFRI, and REG, 3 alpha were significantly reduced at the end of treatment, along with a significant decrease in frequencies of PD1 plus memory CD4 T cells, CD73 plus regulatory CD4 T cells, and MDC8 plus intermediate monocytes. There was also a transient decrease in CD28, CD57 plus senescent CD4 and CD8 T cells. Key 67 plus CD4 T cells, CCR2 plus non-classical monocytes, and myeloid dendritic cells increased over time. There were no significant changes in other inflammatory markers or HIV DNA slash RNA levels. These findings suggest that cannabinoids may help reduce systemic inflammation in PWH on ART, and further research is needed to confirm these results. This article was authored by Ralph Sidney Mbombaboasa, Eve Como, Yulia Alexandrova, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.